Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Jordan's Tractor Vlog videos. I'm sorry I haven't posted much in a while. I've been very busy. Um, I'm in the process of moving out of my house I'm currently at and trying to find a home and trying to restore this uh, wheel horse lawn ranger. And that's what this is going to be. This is a 1963 to 64 model wheel horse lawn ranger. Um, this tractor came in, it was a very basket case, pretty rough. And piece by piece, we uh, tractor was fully sandblasted. And once it came back home, as you see, the paint is very, very glassy. And the paint is like glass. Very nice tractor. And uh, just this tractor was very rough. And this is kind of what I've been working on. Uh, rear rims were completely shot. So I'm trying to find rims. The front rims are also completely shot. I found those new straddle and choke cables and new choke. These all these are is from like Dorman uh, choke from like a uh, for a car or old school trucks. Those are from like O'Reilly's. Um, this is the original air cleaner that was on the Tecumseh engine when I came apart. This engine was the engine that was on here was locked up and blown up. So this was uh, off a snow blower that a uh, wheel horse snow thrower I had that ran good. So I changed all the stuff. We cut that little reverse shaft off. Got this adjusted yet so I can put the exhaust on the clamp. I got the original wheel horse screws for the hood. Footrests are on. Got an NOS uh, decal. Choke is hooked up. New, new bushing in there. Found the nice wheel horse cover seat that was on eBay. Came out really nice, really tight fit. I don't think it's going to come off. Tractor is looking 100. It is so shiny that the phone does not like it. Oh my god. It's really cold out here too. So the other problem is, is this cover I painted. This was originally what they would have had. Got it all nicely done. I went to go bolt it up. The holes didn't line up. The engine shroud that was rusted on this, I had another engine shroud, so I used this one. Well, of course, that cover doesn't line up with this, so I'm having to use this style of thing. So that being said, this is going to come off, get painted. Um, I'm just got to put the gas tank in, run the fuel line up, fuel filter, on and off valve, put gas to it, get it running, make sure the on and off switch is hooked up correctly. The matter of putting a belt on, the spring, the brake band, the wheels, the front tires, both the hood on. Put some stickers on the hood, and she is dialed in. The hood is right here. The hood was made out of two hoods to make one good hood. It was welded together. A little bit of body work, a little bit of bondo, and it did not turn out half too bad. And of course, you know, they look so good, and then you can travel and bring them back home, and then, boop, that happened. So... Wheel horses on there. So it is fantastic. The cover that goes on the side of the brake band and the belt guard, which is right here. So that is what I'm working on. That is for the camper. I will give you guys a video of the new camper tomorrow. So it is right now up here in Wisconsin. It is probably, I think, about like 10 o'clock. I'm going to post this video tomorrow, so I will post a new camper video another day. So, this is kind of what I'm working on, guys. Be sure, like this video. I will post more videos of this project. Also, hit that subscribe button and see where this takes us. So, thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.